Daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince and Miller Entertainment TV. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Remember to follow us on all our social media platforms. We're on Instagram, Prince Miller Entertainment, Facebook, or Prince Miller Entertainment, Facebook group, or Prince and Miller Entertainment TV. We're available on Twitter at P Miller EAT. Welcome to another edition of our daily news, breaking news, everyday news. So, guys, uh, this uh, latest news, yeah, Anita. Yes, uh, suspected as an PF activist were allegedly murdered. A citizens coalition for change quick activists in February are reported the threatening witnesses against testifying Bonin Hube was stabbed twice with a spear at a triple C rally held at Mbizo shopping center and died on admission on Kwekwe, a central hospital. The deceased sister Judith Nube said she was kidnapped on Thursday evening by a suspected ZNPF activist who threatened to kill her if she continued demanding answers into Mbonini's murder. Speaking to the standard, Judy said she now feared for her life following the abductions incident. Uh, she said it was around 4 p.m. when the incident happened. They grabbed and bundled me into their vehicle. They took me to a ZNPF base in Kwekwe where they threatened to make me disappear if I kept on pressing for answers to the killing of my brother. His killers are known and all I want is closure and justice. The incident was reported to the police and the case number is CRO 0422. Also speaking to the standard, Yuji's lawyer, Dalinton Maranke of the Zimbabwe Human Rights NGO Forum said she identified some of the culprits that were implicated in the murder, including some known ruling party bigwigs. She has been saying that police are refusing to take the names of the perpetrators we are now considering visiting the police to iron this out because it falls under their duties to check the report as is and to investigate it appears there's some resistance but this is something that we have to iron out we are also considering getting a peace order against the people who have been harassing her she now lives in fear and we have to now take that route of a peace order to ensure her safety the issue of SF is now of paramount importance outside other legal routes that we want to take. Other people willing to testify against Nube killers were being harassed constantly. Bizo AP elect settlement queen claimed the Zimbabwe public police that P arrested 16 and PF youths for Nube's murder, but later released 11 of them. The late Nube recently remarried following the death of his first wife with whom he had an eight year old daughter and so guys that's the latest here regarding to the situation and is uh piper piper and uh, these guys are threatening the witnesses who are supposed to be testifying against uh, those uh, five people who are still in police custody and the other remand at the moment so we're going to keep you guys in the loop for getting any new information regarding this situation i'm not surprised that uh, people are doing this and yeah uh, situation but some of the guys I don't want to see community momo I don't want to see my links are to one day and yeah but anyway go ziga in go zi I need to do big wig and richi go zingos and yeah so uh some they might um escape this but don't go zi each other it power and yeah so this is our daily news breaking news everyday news we're gonna keep you guys in the loop for getting any new information regarding this whole situation to go to now I'm born in Nube uh, may you so rest in peace, man. The man died um, from a campaign in my by elections in Kwekwe. We all know the situation. It was a very tense situation, and that wasn't supposed to happen, but it happened. And uh, so, daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince and Miller Entertainment TV. Thank you guys for listening and watching. When I keep you guys in the loop, I can take any new information regarding this place up. Synesthetic.